In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to get your Claude 4.5 Sonnet API key. To do this, we'll be using another website known as OpenRouter.ai. This step is important as it acts like our first stop on this journey. So let's dive in. First, you'll want to hop over to your web browser and head straight to OpenRouter.ai. Once you're there, you'll find a search bar conveniently located at the top left of the screen. That's your starting point. In that search bar, type Sonnet, and like magic, the latest version should appear right away. Once you see it, give it a click. Now at the bottom of the page, you will find the providers for Sonnet 4.5. It's important to glance over them so you know who's supporting this version. Now on the right-hand side, you'll notice an option labeled API. Go ahead and click that next. This will take you to another screen, inviting you to create an API. At this point, you might encounter a prompt asking you to log in or sign up. Take your time with this step. If it's your first visit, you'll need to create an account, but if you already have one, simply log in using your credentials. Feel free to pause the video here while you log in. Don't worry, we'll be right here waiting when you get back. Once you've logged in successfully, look for the Create API button and click it. Now comes the fun part. You'll get to create a name for your API key. Try to pick something memorable, perhaps related to the project or app you're planning to integrate with. You're also asked to set a credit limit. This is a crucial step for those concerned about managing API costs. You can set a limit that reflects your expected usage, or if you're feeling adventurous and confident, you can leave this field blank, which defaults to unlimited usage. Once you're satisfied, go ahead and click Create. Congratulations, you now have your very own API key. It's crucial to note that you'll want to copy this key immediately. If you navigate away or close this window, the API key won't be displayed again, and you'll need to generate a new one if that happens. With that sorted, you can now use this key with OpenAI compatible applications or even your own code. And there you have it, your gateway to creating some amazing projects using the Claude 4.5 Sonnet API. If this video helped you, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel, and ring that notification bell to keep up with our latest uploads. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.